everybody and welcome back. Today I have a very special guest with me and you may know her as the one, the only Lady Bass. Today I brought with me Isabella. We are going out. Today is supposed to be scorching hot weather and we are going to try and scrape together a five fish limit now. Let's get going. Ready to go Isabella? Let's go. So we are at the first spot. Right now we are on top of a deep shoal. All along that shoreline over there is where the fish were spawning. And now they are in post-spawn mode. So they are coming in to deeper water. So we are going to start here and then we're pretty much just going to drift a long stretch of water and see if we can get any. So I haven't been on Erie this year yet, it's my first time here with Avery, uh, but I have been fishing Lake Simcoe a fair bit this year and um, the dynamic of the smallmouth is pretty similar, uh, especially in the areas that we're fishing where they spawn super, super shallow, you can catch them shallow um, as soon as they spawn and then after they make their way down to reefs and to deeper points um, where they stay for the summer. Okay, so we are covering a large mass of water. We have two rods that we are using. Because we are in the Great Lakes, we can use two rods. So we got one dragging, and then we've got one that we're casting, and that way we cover all parts of the water column. <laughs> there you go. Rock? Oh, it's a fish? It's a fish. You wanna grab this rod for me? <laughs> that feels a lot of life. It's a fish. Oh my god. It's a fish. <laughs> no way. <laughs> We almost had two lines stuck together there. <laughs> I have to drop that rod that to grab this crazy. one. Oh but my goodness. We're on. We're on. Not sure if it's a smallmouth yet. We do have sheep head here, but we're on to our first fish of the day on that uh, dragging setup that we have going. Covering the whole water column, like Avery said. And uh, this fish was on bottom and wanted to eat, so. Man, that thing is I don't so think this hard. is a smallmouth, but we're gonna have a look here. <laughs> that feels so much line. It feels so much line. Oh, I'm excited to see what it is. Me too. Oh, you see him, Avery? Oh yeah. Oh, it's a sheep head. It's a sheep head. It's a big sheep head. We got ourselves a sheep head, guys. It's a big one. Oh, it's a big one. <laughs> oh my goodness. Ready? Yep. There we go. Oh my god. That's that a big huge. sheep head. <laughs> All right, guys, first fish of the day right here. It is a sheep head, not what we're going after, but uh, put up a good fight, peeled some drag. It's probably my biggest one I've ever caught, actually. I uh, just started peeling drag. Thank you, buddy, for a nice fight. Tell your small friends to come out and play. That was awesome. <laughs> that was awesome. Great fight for a first fish. Like I said, not, not the species we're going after, but nope. definitely, uh, Brightens our morning up a little bit, that's for sure. Yes. So we are dragging bottom with our, uh, our, our second rods. And there's a lot of shells and rocks and other debris down there. So you do have to check your line every once in a while. So I just caught that sheep head. Um, the line actually right in front of my bait is perfectly fine. But I, when I move my fingers up a little bit right there, you guys can probably see that it's frayed. So you do want to retie that. I am using 10 pound line, so it isn't very, um, I would probably be fine if I didn't have to, if I didn't retie, but I do want to be careful here because we do have a chance at a very, very big smallmouth. So better safe than sorry. I'm going to retie and get back at it. I'm getting bit, I'm getting bit, I'm getting bit. Got him, got him. Oh no, I missed him. He, he's still, I got him, I got him this got time. Him. Fish on. Fish is on, let's go. Oh, it looks like it's gonna drop. It's a smallie, it's a smallie. It's a nice smallie. It's a smallie. Let's go. That's a big fish, Avery. Oh, I'm excited. Wow. He's peeling, he's peeling, he's peeling. He was right close to the boat. That's a big fish, Avery. That's a big fish. Oh, he's peeling line. Oh, 
won't stop. It won't stop. <laughs> oh, there he is. Here he goes. Yeah! Woohoo! First smolly of the day. Good job. <laughs> That's a good smallmouth, Avery. Look at that. Oh, my rhythm wave is gone. First smallie of the day. We got it on the sleek jig. Oh, wow, he hit that three times. I knew that he wanted it. Let's get this guy into the box. So I caught that fish on this sleek jig and I was using this 4.8 jackal rhythm wave um, swim bait and I was just slow cranking it and he went that fish went after it like three times before it fully committed and so I'm gonna quickly rig one up here so this right here is supposed to imitate a bait fish and I think it imitates it pretty well this little tail. I'm just casting it out. I'm letting it sink so that it gets at least to like the middle of the water calm, um, closer to the, and sometimes closer to the bottom, and then I slow crank it in. Got it, fish Got it. on. Oh, oh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. That fish is peeling a lot of line. It's still going. It is still going. Oh my goodness. It is way out far. That looks like a big fish, Avery. Do you like a sheephead? I don't, it hasn't jumped yet, and it feels like it isn't moving very much, except for when it peels <laughs> line. <laughs> so, it is very possible it's a sheephead. I really hope it's just a big bass that doesn't want to jump. Oh, yeah, a big sheephead. A big sheephead. Oh, it's a really big sheephead. Oh my goodness. That's a giant sheephead. There we go. There you go. Yeah! Oh, nice. Look at how big that thing is. So that is sheephead number two of the day. I thought that at first it was a smallmouth because it hit like a smallmouth. It still is a nice surprise though. Let's get this guy back. Oh, fish on bottom. Look. Yeah, and I'm getting bit too right now. Fish on, fish on, fish on, fish on, fish on. On the uh, dragging bait, we got another fish on. Not sure what it is. Oh no, is that a sheephead? Is that another sheephead? I think it's another. Uh, I think it's another yeah, sheephead. Yeah, I think it is. Oh my goodness! <laughs> we can't get away from them today. Avery's right though. These fish fight so hard. They're so fun. There we go. They're just not the species we're going after. Nope. Just a little guy, nothing compared to the one Avery and I got before. We're gonna release him here, quickly. <laughs> Hopefully we can find some smallmouths now. There you go. Got one? Got one. Got oh, one. I, I thought I him? saw it flash. Yeah, yeah, yeah I yeah, see, yeah. see him right there. Yeah. There's another one with him, I think. Oh, come Ooh. over here. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's a drum. <laughs> oh, dang! It's a sheep head. Another one! You ready? Yep. There he goes. goes. <laughs> there you go. Another small sheep head. Back into the water. There we go. Not quite what we we're looking for. I thought for sure I was gonna be a smallmouth. That's really disappointing. So we started off fishing the shoal here, mm -hmm. and then we went up shallow. We just checked up shallow. We didn't really see too much. So let's try right in between where all those thick contour lines are. Okay. Steeper drop off. They might be sitting on that. Fish, yeah. Yeah, woohoo! Fish on! Fish. Get the net going. I think we're to, I think it's a sheep head again, Eve. No! <laughs> that sucks! Man, we can't get away from oh these things. Oh my gosh, he swallowed it. Got, Got him! <laughs> Absolutely choked it. That's awesome to see. Still not the right species, but. At least we're on some fish here. Oh, fish. Fish. Fish on. It was shaking its head like smallmouth. Oh yeah, I Ooh. think it's a smallmouth. It looks like a smallmouth. It feels like smallmouth. Oh yeah, baby. Oh, 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 oh smallmouth. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> smallmouth number two. Feels pretty good. 
He'll eat that good too. Look at that. And he's top of the mill. Ah, go there you go. Smalley number two. Feeding our steelhead skunk right now. Not steelhead. Sheephead skunk. <laughs> Sheephead skunk. So we decided to switch up spots like Isabella said earlier, and it looks like we have found some fish. Hopefully we will catch some more smallmouth on this spot. I have a good feeling about it. We tore up the rhythm wave a little bit, so I'm going to have to change that up. Let's get him into the box. <gasps> stop, 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 stop. There's a fish right there. There's a fish that followed it up. It was dark baby and smallmouth. Oh no! Come back. Come back, fish. If we're gonna catch sheephead, we might as well catch 25 pounders. So where are those at? Well, we have been sucking today, but that is okay. Um, we're at a new spot. Actually, Coach Paul, is he calling me? We hello? Don't FaceTime me, damn it! I miss you guys. <laughs> I can't believe we don't have 29 pounds by now, Spell. What's going on? <laughs> we're slacking a little bit. Yeah, we're slacking. Uh, I don't care. You, got you guys, you, you could get a wicked topwater bite. Wicked. I don't want to screw your dad up. I don't want to stress him out because he gets stressed. <laughs> stressed, Dad. Am I on speaker? Yes, you're on speaker. Oh, oh, okay. Is he in the other boat or your boat? No. He's in our boat. <laughs> oh, damn it, he heard me. <laughs> <laughs> Bye. Bye. So we got intel from Coach Paul and he said ignore the fact that it was stormy yesterday and go in shallow. So that is what we are doing. We are ignoring the fact that it was stormy yesterday and we are going in shallow. Look at how clear the water is here. Oh, that's spy bait water. Wow. That's spy bait water. That's impressive. Wow. Must that have been protected from the wind. So clear. Yeah. No fear. Small mouth. That did not take long. Net, net, net. Where's the net? It's under you, under you. Okay. It's not too Stop. big. We got a good look at him when he jumped, but. Yes! <laughs> Fish number three! There he comes. Oh, there's one right there. Get your oh, big, big one. one. Get, get my drop big shot. One. Get my drop shot. I'm gonna play this. There's two. See them? There's three. Yes. There's three. Perfect. Yeah. And you'll be able to watch him eat it. So make sure your line's tight. I think they might be too interested in my in my fish here. Yeah, they're too interested in my fish. You have to go right, right at right my fish. Yeah, right here. See, they're swimming that way. Yeah. There you Got him. Yeah, a little. Fish number three. Little one, but the whole shallow bite seems it's going to be a good deal. Coach Paul told us to go shallow, and he was right. He's a little. We're going to let him go right away here. Perfect. Oh, fish, right under the boat. Oh, oh. Eat it. He looked at my bait. He's still there. He's still there. Yeah, you try. You try. Maybe he'll like the goby better. Oh, he's eating it. Oh my gosh. <laughs> he charged it. Oh, he was so mad at it. He's like playing with me. He's literally following us. Got him? I think I got him. Yep, I got, got him. him. It's little though. It's little, but it's still fish. I got him. Fish is on Smalley number three, four, four. four. Yes, yeah, Smalley number four. We got him, we got him. Oh, he's peeling, man. He is peeling. Almost got it, almost got it. Oh, there yeah! you go. Woohoo! Fish number four. We are almost to a limit. We need one more fish to have a limit. Almost there. Little guy, but that is three in the box. And we need a couple more. I'm fearless. I am fearless. I am fearless. You know, I am fearless. You can't stop me. I'm fearless. 
Well, that is it, folks. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. I had an awesome time filming that Sheephead Smash Fest. And even though we didn't catch a lot of bass, I still had a great time. Thank you so much, Isabella, for coming out. Hopefully, we can get out again together soon. We did not end up filming an outro at the spot, but if you did enjoy this, please click the like button. And if you'd like to see more content like this, please click the big red subscribe button. And always remember to take a kid fishing. They'll have lots of fun.